In the vastness of the universe, where galaxies move in a kind of cosmic choreography, there is an invisible force that permeates all things. This force, known as energy, is the fundamental essence of existence. But what do we really know about this energy that surrounds and constitutes us? Do we understand its true nature and the impact it has on our lives? Energy not only lights up our cities and dries our machines, it is what connects everything that exists from the atoms that make up our bodies to the a most distant stars everything is immersed in a sea of vibrant eternal energy. So what we really need to think about is how can we access this deep and transformative knowledge that energy holds within it. In ancient texts and spiritual traditions, we find an ancient wisdom that tells us about the eternity of energy. Some texts say energy never dies. It only transforms this concept, leads us to a profound reflection. If energy is eternal and always transforms, what does this mean for us human beings on our life? Journey when we look at the universe, see we see that energy is in constant movement constantly, recreating and renewing itself in the same way our lives are also in continuous flow, shaped by experiences and learning. As energy beings, we are constantly influencing and being influenced by these invisible forces. Every thought, emotion, and action we take emits a vibration that contributes to our personal and collective reality. That's why understanding the nature of energy can transform our lives in profound and meaningful ways. So today we'll explore the secrets of energy and how it can be the key I to unlocking unlimited potential within us. But that's not all you'll discover the fundamental role of energy in the universe and how it can guide you towards a fuller, more connected life. We'll also explore some physical and mathematical concepts that perhaps will challenge your understanding of the role of energy in your life, but for this I ask you to open your mind and your heart, because this knowledge can change the way you see the world and yourself. Energy is the vital force that permeates the entire universe, something that cannot be seen, but woe. Ose effects are felt deeply in simple terms. Energy is the capacity to do work to move and transform matter. Everything we see and experience is in some way a manifestation of this energy. It is the sunlight that warms our days, the electricity that lights up our nights, and the force that pulls pules in every cell of our bodies. In physics, energy is categorized in various ways. Kinetic potential, thermal, electrical, chemical, nuclear, and others. Each of these forms of energy can be transformed into another, maintaining the essence that energy is never lost. Only tar, ands formed, this principle is a reflection of the eternal. Creation and destruction that we observe OBV in the cosmos, from a spiritual perspective energy, is often compared to the concept of soul or spirit. The eternal essence that dwells in all living beings, just as physical energy never dies, only changes form. Many spiritual traditions believe that our souls are also eternal, going through a cycle of rebirth and transformation. Reincarnation, for example, is seen as a contine OUS renewal, where the soul learns, grows, and evolves with each life, with that in my. And imagine energy as an endless river flowing endlessly moving, through time and space, shaping and being shaped by everything it touches. Each of us is a drop in that river contributing to the larger flow, while also being transformed by it. The energy that makes up our bodies and minds has existed in many forms before for us and will continue to exist long after we are gone. This perspective invites us to see life as a continuous cycle of transformation and renewal, where nothing is really lost but rather reinvented. The law of conservation of energy is one of the a fundamental pillars of physics. It states that energy can neither be created nor destroyed. It only changes form this principle, not only underpins the scientific understanding of the universe, but also reflects deeply with many spiritual philosophies in everyday life. We can observe this law in action in various ways when we eat the chemical energy stored in nutrients is converted into kinetic and thermal energy, allowing us to move and keep our bodies warm, 
and when we turn on a light bulb, electrical energy is transformed into light and heat. But even emoti, ons and thoughts can be seen as forms of energy that influence our physical and mental state spiritually. The conservation of energy reminds us of the interconnectedness of all things, if energy is never lost, but only transformed. So all our actions, thoughts, and feelings have a lasting impact on the world around us. Every act, every thought, every emotion contributes to a larger energy field, which influences reality in ways that we may not be able to see immediately, but which are real and powerful. This is also one of the reasons I always tell you about. The importance of our responsibility for the energy and frequency. We emit our choices are not just isolated events. They reverberate through existence, shaping the future in subtle but significant ways. This understanding of energy as eternal and interconnected also leads us to reflect how can we use this knowledge to improve our lives and the world around us? How can we become more aware of the energies we emit and receive? And how can we harmonize them to achieve a state of balance and peace as we deepen our understanding of energy? We discover that it M manifests in different frequencies and vibrations each. Frequency has unique characteristics that can influence matter and life in surprising ways. Modern science teaches us that all things living or not vibrate at a specific frequency. These vibrations are in fact the tangible manifestation of energy in action. The atoms that make up our bodies, for example, are in constant motion, vibrating in rhythms that create the substance of who we are. These frequencies have a profound impact on our emotions, and mental states music, for example, can prov, provoke a sar, ice of emotions from joy and excitement to sadness and melancholy, all depending on the frequencies and harmonies used in the same way our emotions and thoughts have their own frequencies that can influence our physical health and emotional well-being. The connection between human frequencies and emotions is a fascinating area rich in potential for self-knowledge and healing understanding. These dynamics leads us to reflect on how we can adjust our own frequencies to achieve a state of harmony and balance, just as a musical instrument needs to be tuned, to produce a pleasant sound our bodies and minds can be. Adjusted through practices that raise our frequencies, such as meditation, therapeutic music, and other forms of energy healing. One of the most promising applications of this knowledge is harmonic wave resequencing, this concept. Although it may sound complex, is based on the simple idea that we can use specific frequencies to realign and harmonize the vibrations of our body. This technique has the potential to heal, diseases, relieve pain, and restore energy balance. The practical application of this tech, Nike can be seen in treatments that use sound and vibration to promote healing. Specific frequencies can be directed to areas of the body that are, are out of balance, helping to restore health and vitality. This approach recognizes that health is not just the absence of disease, but a state of balance and harmony at all levels of being, and it is from this knowledge of energy and frequency that we inevitably arrive at the intersection with human consciousness. Energy is not just a physical force that moves the universe, it is also intrinsically connected to our MEI and, and spirit consciousness. The ability to perceive, think, and feel is a direct manifestation of the energy that flows through us. The theory of biocentrism proposed by Dr. Robert Lanza offers a fascinating perspective on this connection according to biocentrism. Life and consciousness are fundamental to the construction of the universe, not just a byproduct of it. In other words, the universe exists because there are conscious beings to observe it. This theory challenges the traditional view that consciousness arises only as a side effect of matter and suggests that consciousness and energy are inseparable aspects of the same reality. When we consider that everything in the universe is energy, vibrating at different frequencies, we begin to understand that our consciousness is in fact fact, a highly organized and complex form of this energy. Our thoughts, emotions, and perceptions are expressions of the frequencies at which our consciousness operates. Every positive or negative thought, every emotion of love or fear alters our energy field, which in turn 
influences the world around us, this inter. Connection manifests in various ways in our daily lives, for example. Have you ever noticed, no, it, how being around someone cheerful and positive can lift your own spirits? Or how negative thoughts can seem to drain your physical energy? These phenomena illustrate how the energy of human consciousness is fluid and interconnected, constantly interacting with other energies around us. In the collective context, events of great magnitude, such as celebrations, natural disasters, or global crises, all also demonstrate the interconnection between energy and cons. Shisness, when a large number of people share an Intense emotions such as joy during a celebration or fear during a crisis, this collective energy can create a powerful field that influences the behavior and emotions of individuals within that group. This interconnection between energy and consciousness invites us to live more consciously and intentionally. Each thought and emotion is a vibration we send out into the universe, and these vibrations have the power to shape our reality. When we become more aware of our own energies, we can align our act, ions and intentions with the harmonious forces of the cosmos. Promoting a continuous cycle of growth and positive transformation as we explore the interconnection between energy and consciousness, we are also faced with the need to understand how mathematics, the language of the universe, describes these interactions. Current mathematical conventions, while powerful and widely applied, have significant limitations when it comes to capturing the true nature of energy and its relationship with consciousness. Traditional mathematics, with its precise formulas and equations, was developed to describe physical phenomena. In a three-dimensional world, although effective in many aspects, ECTs, it often fails to explain phenomena that transcend these dimensions such as quantum fluctuations, the nature of consciousness, and the complex energy interactions that occur at subtle levels. The vibrational nature of reality requires a mathematical approach that can incorporate these oscillations and their effects on matter and consciousness to overcome these limitations. New mathematical models are being developed, these models, SEA, act to incorporate principles of frequency resonance and Non-linear dynamics to provide a more precise and comprehensive description of energy, they challenge the status quo proposing that our current understanding is just one piece of a much larger puzzle among the most interesting proposals are theories that incorporate sacred geometry and fractal mathematics. Sacred geometry with its form, terms and patterns found in nature offers a vision of how energy organizes itself and manifests itself on a variety of scales. Fractals, on the other hand, reveal how CE complex structures can emerge from simple repetitive patterns, reflecting the self-similar nature of energetic reality. A practical example of these new approaches is string theory, which suggests that the fundamental particles of the universe are not points, but but vibrating strings, whose interactions create the reality. We perceive this theory not only expands our understanding of subatomic particles, but also suggests that the music of the spheres, an ancient concept, may be an accurate metaphor for the structure of the cosmos. Another fascinating proposal is VI, Ortex Mathematics, which explores how vortices and toroidal fields can explain phenomena that traditional linear equations cannot. This model suggests that all forms of energy from electrons to galaxies follow spiral movement patterns constantly creating and destroying in an eternal cycle of transformation. These approaches also have profound implications for our understanding of consciousness. If consciousness is a manifestation of energetic patterns, adjusting these patterns can alter states of consciousness, promoting experiences of expansion and enlighten. Meant these theories not only expand our scientific understanding, but also bring us closer to a unified vision of reality, where science and spirituality meet this integration, can lead us to a new era of discovery, where the mathematics of energy becomes a tool for personal and collective transformation. Sacred geometry is an ancient science that studied the patterns and shapes that are the building blocks of the universe, from the tiny patterns on mollusk shells to the vast spirals of galaxies. 
sacred geometry reveals an underlying order that governs all things sacred geometry is made up of specific shapes and proportions that are considered sacred because of their ability to create harmony and balance notable examples include the circle, the triangle, the square, the P pentagon, and more complex shapes such as the Doic Kedron and the Icosahedron. Among these, the flower of life is perhaps the most emblematic, consisting of multiple overlapping circles that form an intricate and harmonious pattern. These geometric shapes also have unique energetic properties. Sacred geometry acts as a bridge between the physics, al and spiritual worlds translating energetic, vibrations into forms we can see and touch. Each shape and pattern resonates at a specific frequency, influencing the energy around it. The relationship between energy and sacred geometry also extends to spiritual practices. Many ancient cultures used these shapes in their temples, monuments and rituals, believing they could amplify spiritual energies and facilitate connection with the divine meditation based on geometric patterns, such as visualizing the flower of life are used to harmonize and elevate. Consciousness demonstrating the profound interconnection between form energy and spirit nature, for example, is dominated by curves, spirals and waves reflecting the fluid and continuous dynamics of energy. This natural curvature is a direct manifestation of how energy moves and organizes itself. Self, the straight lines often used in human constructions are a convenient simplification, but they do not reflect the complexity and beauty of the natural universe. In nature, everything from the path of rivers to the structure of mountains is made up of curves. This is due to the fact that energy when in motion follows, Trajectories that minimize resistance and maximize efficiency, resulting in curved and spiral shapshees. These curved shapes are especially evident when we consider phenomena such as the Fibonacci spiral, which can be seen in the growth of seashells, the arrangement of sunflower seeds, and even the formation of galaxies. The Fibonacci spiral is a mathematical expression of the golden ratio and exemplifies how nature uses curves to create structures that are both efficient and aesthetically harmonious. The importance of curves and waves in the manifestation of energy is also evident in quantum physics and wave theory. Subatomic particles, such as electrons, do not move in straight lines but in wave patterns, exhibiting behavior that defies the laws of classical physics. These wave movements are the basis for string theory, which posits that the fundamental particles of the universe are actually vibrating. Strings creating the various IOUs forms of matter and energy through their vibrations. Natural curvature also applies to our own life experience. Our purrs. Onal journeys rarely follow a straight line they are full of. Twists and turns reflecting the dynamic nature of existence. Accepting this curvature can help us understand that challenges and changes are natural parts of the energy flow, leading us to growth and transformation. Understanding the nature of, of energy and its interconnection with consciousness opens up a vast field of possibilities to improve our daily lives. Energy is always around and within us, influencing our health, emotional and mental well-being and our environment. One of the most immediate uh, peplications of this knowledge is in improving health practices, such as meditation, yoga, and conscious breathing are powerful ways to align our internal energy. These practices help release energy blockages, reduce stress, and promote healing meditation. For example, can calm the mind and reduce the activity of the sympathetic nervous system responsible for the stress response by cultivating a state of deep relaxation. We allow our body to activate its own healing power. Another effective technique is sound therapy, which uses specific frequencies to realign our NT. Arnal vibrations sound such as Tibetan bowls, gongs, and mantras can help balance the chakras, the body's energy centers promoting a state of integral well-being besides improving the quality of sleep.
This technique reduces anxiety and increases the general feeling of well-being. But simple practices such as spending time in nature can also have a profound impact on our energy. Nature is a reservoir of pure and balanced energy, and by connecting with it, we can recharge our own energies to align our energy with the universe. It is also essential to cult. I've eight positive thoughts and emotions practices of gratitude. Compassion and love can raise our vibration, creating a higher and more positive energy field energy. Not only impacts our health and well-being, but also plays a crucial role in our spiritual growth. Spiritual growth is in essence a process of raising our vibration and expanding our consciousness. Working with the chakras is fundamental to spiritual growth. Each chakra is associated with specific aspects of our life and consciousness, and keeping them balanced is essential for our spiritual well-being. Techniques such as color visualization, the use of crystals, and the practice of specific mantras for each chakra can help align these energy centers, promoting a harmonious flow of energy throughout our body. But there is something equally important in this process, remembering to live with intention and awareness. In every moment, I would say that this is the key to aligning our energy with the universe. Since every thought, word, and action is an expression of our energy, by becoming more aware of how we use this energy, we can create a life that resonates with harmony, peace, and joy these practices and reflections on. In our life and spiritual growth, lead us to a deeper understanding of ourselves and the universe. They invite us to live more consciously and intentionally harnessing the transformative power of energy to create a life full of meaning and connection. So remember, we are beings of energy eternally connected to the universal flow. Thank you for embarking on this journey with me. If this video resonated with you, I invite you to like and subscribe to our channel. Share this video with others so they can, I be, benefit from this message and don't forget to leave a comment below sharing your thoughts, reflections and experiences, Thanks again for watching and for joining me. Take care and see you soon.